So day two of Maritime Race Weekend, the 16th of September, started off where the 15th of September ended. I did an impromptu medal shoot with my previous night's finisher's medal. And then I went off to the races. I went off to the races in very warm conditions. The humidity was close to the ground and I felt it the entire 5k. So much so that about 3k on my way back I saw the 55 minute pace bunny for the 10k. I was actually very afraid at that point because 55 minutes for the 10k runners is pretty amazing. And that would have been my plan C. See, I always have a plan A, B, and C. I have not had to use my plan C yet, but I have had to use my plan A and plan B most of the time. So, I actually, surprisingly, came around the corner, the last corner, and up the finish line, shoot and uh, came in under 55 minutes so I'm proud to say plan A went out the door but plan B was mighty fine. It was my second worst 5k but it was probably one of my more memorable 5k's because of Becca Schofield in my heart and I wouldn't normally say that but the night before with my grandmother's passing and it being the exact same day I had this sense of relief. And don't get me wrong, I know Becca's purpose is to spread ran random acts of kindness like confetti and happiness and kindness like confetti. And really, I learned a lot. So, I'll give you my special, very special photos of my medals. After we went to visit some friends of mine who have a business who uses the Alderney Landing Market in Dartmouth, we went to visit the newly minted father of this duo and mom was at home with the twins and then off I went to Citadel Hill where I saw the noon cannon and where I spent about an hour and did that amazing photo shoot I mentioned. And I'll insert those photos at the end of this clip. Maritime Race Weekend was amazing. This weekend was something that made me emotional but Reminded me of so much and how lucky I really am. Run on, folks. Run on. A great day, a great meal. Bye, Nova Scotia. Hey, New Brunswick, we're home. So, the Monday after race weekend, I finally get to use my mug and it's got pumpkin chai tea. Yum! 